Okay guys, this is Ghost Hunter Dan. We are at the place where the two rivers meet. Kishwaukee River is dumping into the Rock River. Larry, go ahead and point over. So right over there, and, and the water's up right now, guys, but this is where Black Hawk gathered his warriors. So this is the Kishwaukee River behind us. It's the Rock River over here. Now I have caught a picture to what looks like four men moving moving together on horseback over across there never really put it out but that's what we're thinking it is so we will put that picture out we're going to do a ghost box session here on the bridge understand we don't think there's an active haunting here but we could catch something residual because this is where they gathered so we're going to do a ghost box session so here we go ghost box session number one july 1st 2018 ghost hunter dan ghost hunter larry tessa Haley. And Haley, sorry. Guys, one thing I want to say, we are on a major roadway that goes into Rockford, plus, uh, right at the end of the edge of the Rockford Airport. Okay. Is there anybody here that wants to talk to us? Were you a member of Blackhawk's British band? I kind of thought I heard Blackhawk real quick. Mm -hmm. I didn't quite hear you. Were you a member of Blackhawk's British band? What was your name? I thought I heard a response. But it could have very well been an Indian. Tessa and I were talking about this earlier today, is if we wondered if we'd get English responses or if we'd get Native American tongue. We'll just have to keep going and see. There's a fishing boat going under us. Um, what year is it where you're at? I'm sorry, what year is it where you're at? This is part of the crappy thing and when you're on a place like this. Do you agree with Blackhawk coming back across the Mississippi River? I don't know. Yeah, I heard like no, I don't. I, I heard a distinct no. Were you Sauk or Winnebago tribe? Potawatomi? Settler? Were you an Illinois, Northern Illinois settler? Were you a member of a tribe? It sounded like it said Winnebago, real lightly. So if you're a part of the Winnebago tribe, that means you married into the Sauk tribe. You guys married one another, correct? We did. Did you hear it? It said we did. <laughs> so, another car, guys. Hang on a minute. Okay, I have one more question. Did you want war or did you want peace? 
Peace. Peace. That was very. Peace. That was distinct. Peace. Very quick too. Okay, we thank you for talking with us. Would you like us to come back and talk to you again? I heard a really quick, okay, we're here. Okay. Okay, well, we do thank you for talking to us and we will come back, so thank you. Okay, guys. I think the best thing to do for next time would be to come late, late at night. Right. Although it hasn't been a problem yet, you do tend to get more planes at night, right. but less cars. Right. Well, this road is the main road between Route 72 and, like I said, if Larry pans to where that car is coming from, the Rockford Airport lays just over those trees. And we were when we first got here, before we started rolling, uh, a plane literally was taken off. And I mean, we could read the numbers of it coming over the treetops. So um, this is this is where Blackhawk gathered his warriors. I did have a question on a YouTube video uh, a few years back that how I was sure about this because I've researched it. The two rivers don't meet anywhere else. This is the Kishwaukee right behind Larry. Pan and grab that Tessa. That's the Kishwaukee. Tessa pan back around. That is the rock. The two rivers do not meet anywhere else in the state of Illinois besides right here. It's on many historic accounts. Even the Blackhawk series, which was wonderfully done on YouTube by a, by a site called the Blackhawk War, even confirms that. So I'm pretty sure this is where this was at. Um, well, plus you also got the picture over there, too. Plus I've also got the picture, which those guys were just slightly... Now, the, the rivers are up right now because we've had tons of rain, but they were slightly in the water. 187 years ago, this, these two rivers might have been routed a little differently. I would venture to say that up here on the high ground, which you can't see it now, but I think you can probably see it in other videos that I've done, this is up on the bluff. He probably more likely had his guys up there to protect the high ground. So militarily, that's the only way to go. You've got to protect the high ground. So this is Ghost Hunter Dan, Ghost Hunter Larry behind the camera, sensitive Tessa over here. What's your name again? I'm so sorry. Haley. Haley. Right? Haley's taking all of our UV Haley's pictures today. UV pictures Say hi, Haley. So we're going to end this. We're going to get out of here because we're about to get carried away by mosquitoes. And uh, the traffic's not going to let up. So we did get some good stuff. Larry will get it thrown up as soon as we can. So thank you very much, and we'll see you guys in the next one.